to use blockchain technology in business. Due to the hype and buzz around cryptocurrency these days, your view of how to use blockchain technology may be affected. With more people talking about raising money through the sale of digital coins, there is a misunderstanding about the actual value of building a business. As an entrepreneur looking to create new value for their business, the best thing to focus on is the underlying technology. Here's how to maximize your business with blockchain technology. Focus on customer management. You have to create a value proposition with your client lifecycle in mind if you want to gain the benefits of using blockchain technology. This is the secret behind SAP's success, a company making $22 billion a year in revenue. Don't launch your business as a token. The association of cryptocurrencies with blockchain technology has made it increasingly more difficult for many to distinguish between the peer-to-peer -peer network and the time-stamping server and cryptocurrency itself. Blockchain technology is merely a database, and a cryptocurrency is a form of digital money. A token is simply a feature of a blockchain business, and not a company by itself, which means if you want to succeed in business, you should focus on a particular product rather than launching your business as tokens. Don't mistake a Series A with an ICO. You should never view an initial coin offering ICO, as an alternative to a Series A round of funding. Trying to create a token on a blockchain with no business function in mind will never allow you to raise money. While Bitcoin has done very well, its success can only be attributed to its excellent technology. Be ready to learn. Before you can venture into a blockchain-powered business, you need to dedicate some time to gain a better understanding of blockchain technology. Only after you've gained a general knowledge of the technology will you be able to decide whether an ICO or a Series A will serve the interests of your business. Entrepreneurs who have a solid understanding of blockchain technology can solve a real problem in the industry. Keep those simple tips in mind before deciding if utilizing blockchain technology will benefit your business. In this presentation, I'm going to show you the top things to avoid when investing in cryptocurrency. Investing in cryptocurrency is relatively new, that if careful, investors can consider when they are looking to diversify their assets. However, before you dive in and start investing in cryptocurrency, you should consider these five things to avoid when investing, so you can make the smartest decision to meet your needs. Not considering problems of fraud and security. Cryptocurrency is steeped in digital technology, with every transaction, from mining to purchasing and selling, taking place online. This can pose a serious threat, according to regulators, because you can easily fall into the trap of participating in fake exchanges. Do your research and verify the legitimacy of the exchanges and their security processes for all transactions. Avoid high fees one way that you may be able to avoid the high fees associated with trading cryptocurrencies is by buying and selling through a cryptocurrency wallet. This is something that you can download on your smartphone. While cryptocurrency wallets still have transaction fees, they won't be nearly as high as the fees at an exchange. Avoid buying derivatives When looking for your next cryptocurrency investment, crypto derivative trading may not be the way to go. Derivatives, including Bitcoin futures, have the potential for more significant losses. While it's impossible to predict the crypto market, you can utilize smart investing practices to save you from making a detrimental investment. Cashing it all in. Diversifying your portfolio can be your guarantee against losing everything. Cryptocurrency has become known for its volatile nature, and its unpredictability regarding returns can either provide you a huge profit or a devastating loss. Selling when emotionally hyped When trading in digital currencies, it's best to remain level-headed as much as possible. When you continually reevaluate your position, you can determine the best strategy to make. Also, it's best to keep in mind that you don't want to invest more than you can afford to lose when investing in cryptocurrencies. When it comes to investing in cryptocurrency, there are no hard or fast rules that you need to follow. Always take the time to do the research and always think twice before making a decision. Make sure that you are taking the necessary time to make the best choices for your specific situation. In this tutorial, I'm going to share with you some easy tips for getting started in cryptocurrency trading. Over the last several years, cryptocurrency has become one of the most dominating markets that have successfully overshadowed almost every other market in the world. 
While investing in cryptocurrency is extremely rewarding, it is also hazardous. If you want to succeed in crypto trading, you have to follow specific rules. Here are some easy tips to consider when it comes to trading in cryptocurrency. Tip number one, determine your crypto strategy. Before you decide to jump on the crypto bandwagon, you want to determine your strategy and your style of trading. Cryptocurrencies are great short-term and long-term investments. Those traders who focus on short-term investment are day traders and tend to stay in a position for a maximum number of hours and is a riskier proposition. With long-term investing, you don't need to watch the market every day. Tip number two, don't panic when prices drop. The cryptocurrency market is known for its unpredictability, and those who decide to trade in the market can't panic when the value drops, especially if your crypto strategy includes long-term investing. First-time investors who don't know how the market operates can make hasty decisions that they later regret. The best thing to remember is never base your trade decisions on fear or panic. Tip number three, choose a reputable broker. You want to pick a crypto company that is not only licensed, but one that is also trusted by traders. Every crypto company will have its own fees, and if you choose wisely, you could save a lot of money on your trades. You also have to be careful about the many scams and brokers that have a terrible reputation. Tip number four, don't fall for scams. When the cryptocurrency market was first starting out, there were numerous scams to be wary of. Cryptocurrency scams have similar signs which are easy to detect. Be careful of claims of incredible investment returns, opportunities for a limited number of people, and fully automated systems. Tip number five, know your financial options. With 1,000% gains, it can be tempting to invest everything you have in cryptocurrency. However, this can quickly turn into an issue. Since cryptocurrency is still relatively new, its future development is still somewhat uncertain. This means that as a crypto trader, you should only invest money that you can afford to lose. Understanding three different types of blockchain technology. Cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and Ethereum have become a hot investment over the last several years because of its seemingly get-rich-quick potential. However, before you dive into this new asset class, it's important to understand the three types of popular blockchain technology. Public Blockchain This type of blockchain allows anyone in the world to download the data and read the data. This means that anyone is allowed to participate in the consensus process and can write the data or block into the public blockchain. There are numerous public blockchains that anyone can invest in and trade. Bitcoin is one of the more well-known blockchains and was the first peer-to-peer -peer cryptocurrency exchange. Ethereum is another popular blockchain that allows anyone to build smart contracts and decentralized apps. Consortium Blockchain A consortium of members controls a consortium blockchain. Because of this, it has a predefined set of nodes for the users with access to writing the data or block. Members of a consortium blockchain may be participating banks, exporters, importers, ports of sending and receiving countries, custom officials, etc. With this kind of blockchain technology, some of the participants may have write access, and some, or all, will have read access. Consortium blockchains aren't as fully decentralized as the public blockchain. Private Blockchain All permissions are kept centralized to an organization with private blockchain technology. This is the kind of blockchain that companies used when they wanted to create their own currencies. One of the significant criticisms of private blockchain technology is that it isn't decentralized, but rather nothing more than a distributed database. However, this allows some organizations to have privacy and compliance requirements to implement blockchain, as well as adding values like cryptographic auditioning and known identities to the internal process. Unfortunately, with private blockchain, the beauty and central idea of decentralization and open protocol get lost. Since 2008, when the first cryptocurrency was introduced, blockchain technology has rapidly gained popularity around the world. As the burgeoning technology continues to be ripe with ongoing innovations, it is best to keep an open mind and expect to see new, related technologies continue to emerge. As the world continues to become interconnected, cryptocurrencies will continue to be an attractive proposition for growing markets, making it all the more important to understand the different technologies available to you. In this presentation, I'm going to provide you with five tips for investing in cryptocurrencies. These days, it seems like everyone is talking about cryptocurrencies, 
and how they can make money by investing in it. However, making money by investing in cryptocurrency isn't as easy as it sounds. As a new technology, most people don't really know how to make it work for them. Here are 5 tips to help you invest in cryptocurrencies and increase your chances of making a profit. Tip number 1. It's not always good to diversify. Investing all your money into one coin is incredibly unsafe and will limit your potential. If you want to diversify the cryptocurrency investments, you have to do it right away. One of the only reasons you want to diversify is to make more money. If you invest money in a coin, don't do it merely because you aren't comfortable putting more into your current target. Diversify your portfolio because you see the potential in that coin and you want to maximize your profits. Tip number two, the only way to profit is by selling. It is important to remember that you only make money when you sell your current investment. If you see the value of your coin skyrocketing, you don't actually turn a profit until you move the value out of the currency. Because of the highly volatile nature of cryptocurrencies, until you transform the value into a more stable form, you haven't made a profit. Tip number three, don't sell until prompted to do so. Much of cryptocurrency trading for many people is dominated by emotion. Rather than making smart decisions based on market movements, many people tend to go with their gut, which results in them taking more losses than they should. Resist the urge to day trade and avoid selling your coins just because you'll make a small profit. Only sell your coins if the circumstances dictate it's a good idea. Tip number four, find the best way to purchase and store your coins. Since cryptocurrency is still in its infancy, its best practices aren't set in stone which mean it might not be helpful to look up information in a guide. You still need to decide for yourself the most efficient way to purchase and store your coins. Tip number five, focus on profit. One of the most significant mental hurdles that you may face is the idea of profit versus the idea of being right. You don't want to just be correct in determining which coins will increase in value, but you also want to profit from them. If you don't invest in the right currencies, you won't make much of a profit. Cryptocurrency trading and speculation can be fun and even profitable if you know what you're doing. The only way you'll be able to make a profit is if you're smart about your purchases and trading. 3 Essential Things You Should Know About Cryptocurrency In this tutorial, I'm going to show you 3 important things that you should know about cryptocurrency before you invest. Digital currencies, unlike many other investments, are incredibly complex and risky. Cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and Ethereum are intriguing because they are unregulated by governments, limited supply, and privacy in financial transactions. However, they are also extremely complicated to understand and can only be purchased through specific online venues and are no longer cheap, which experts say make them a risky investment. Don't buy cryptocurrency because it's trendy. You have to know how to decipher between investing and speculating. If you decide to become an investor in cryptocurrency, only do so with what you can afford to lose and always have an exit strategy. Also, keep your eye out for cryptocurrencies surrounded by less hype that have the potential to build on Bitcoin's strengths. Know the technology. If you are interested in investing in cryptocurrency, you should know how the technology works, how you can use it, and the value it creates. The quickest way for an investor to lose money is to buy into an asset class that they don't understand. You also need to know the fundamentals, like that blockchain technology is a technology that can be used by anyone. While cryptocurrencies are store values, just like other currencies, making their value little to do with the underlying technology. Keep on top of regulatory attempts. Soon, more and more governments will start to announce plans to regulate Bitcoin by controlling the transfer of money into it. This also means that they could launch a major investigation to target the more than 100 million in unpaid taxes related to cryptocurrency gains. Potential investors need to determine if there are compliance risks, legal issues, and regulatory risks before investing in cryptocurrency. The key to understanding these risks is transparency. When it comes to cryptocurrency investing, it is important to remember that what goes up can also go down. Volatility goes both ways, which means that your investment in digital currency can go back to zero just as quickly as it can go up another $1,000.
In this tutorial, you'll learn the four things that you need to know before you invest your hard-earned money in cryptocurrency. After years of unprecedented gains, the cryptocurrency market saw a dramatic drop in value in 2018. The market correction brought everything down and should make you a bit cautious with your crypto investments. Here are four things that you should know before investing your hard-earned income in cryptocurrencies. Understand the risks When investing in cryptocurrency, it is imperative that you understand the inherent risks involved in these kinds of investments. If you are looking to buy into an ICO, know that you are buying into a startup and that most startups fail. Also, it's important to understand that crypto markets are not regulated, making it easier for a few of the more prominent investors to corner the market at your expense. Start small It can be exhilarating to watch the value of cryptocurrency quickly rise. However, because it is still such a volatile market, you want to start small and avoid going all in. Try to keep your crypto exposure to a reasonable level. Your exposure limit will be different than anyone else's and should take in consideration your age, your income, and your level of wealth. You also want to make sure you diversify your crypto holdings. And remember that the more you spread your investments, the more likely you'll make a profit. Be picky. A broad market correction, no matter the investment, will bring everything down, both the good and the bad. Buying during a severe market correction means that you have the opportunity to shop around for great investments at a deep discount. Pay attention to the drivers that support the price of the currency and go after tokens with a strong fundamental demand for the platform they support. Don't be lazy. If you are dead set on buying into ICOs, you need to do a lot of research and get the dirty work done. In the first half of 2018 alone, more than 600 ICOs went to market, creating a lot of white papers to analyze. Before investing in these, you need to make sure that you are good at distinguishing a good startup from a bad one. You need to look at the founders and analyze their expertise and their track record, and determine if certain organizations are backing the blockchain application. Don't let the current downward trend keep you from considering investing in cryptocurrency. With the right amount of research and understanding, you can still invest in cryptocurrency and make a profit. In this tutorial, I'm going to provide you with four key areas for developing blockchain platforms. For businesses, a well-designed blockchain doesn't merely cut out intermediaries, but it can also help to reduce costs, increase reach, speed, transparency, and traceability for many business processes. A distributed ledger technology, blockchain enables an internet-based, peer-to-peer network that works to facilitate exchanges in value. Computers on the network verify and record transactions simultaneously, which can be completed without a traditional intermediary such as a credit card network or a bank. As with many emerging technologies, the main concern with blockchain is trust. While the transparency and immutability of blockchain ledgers can be a significant deterrent to hackers, there is still uncertainty about its vulnerability to fraud. The concerns over trust can be alleviated if there are standards and regulations developed to reduce the risk that blockchain might pose to the users. Here are four key areas to focus on if you want to establish a blockchain platform. Making a case for business If you are looking to develop a blockchain platform, then you have to make a strong case for the business. You need to make sure that the purpose of the initiative for establishing a blockchain platform is both clear and well-conceived. This will allow you to move forward in developing the blockchain platform without confusion. Building an ecosystem When making a blockchain platform, you may find that you have to work with different companies within your industry, and perhaps even your competitors, to create a common set of standards in which to govern the blockchain. A majority of those with a live blockchain application are either leaders or members of a blockchain consortium. Deliberate Design The design of your blockchain platform must be intentional and work with what users can see and do. You may have to work with legal, compliance, and cybersecurity experts to help you develop rules and standards for access permission that will help to prompt trust in the technology. Navigating Regulatory Uncertainty The regulatory requirements of blockchain will continue to evolve. If companies continue to avoid the technology while the rules are being developed, they can run the risk of falling behind of their competition. As you develop standards, engaging regulators can help blockchain users anticipate their next moves. 
Blockchain can no longer be called a key technology for the future because it's already getting significant use today. Understanding the four key areas of focus for developing a blockchain platform will help your business stay ahead of the game. In this presentation, I'm going to share with you the top investment tips for trading in cryptocurrency. The price of Ethereum and Bitcoin have exploded in recent years, begging the question, is there a sufficient upside potential to start investing in cryptocurrencies? In other words, is it still worth looking into investing in cryptocurrencies or is it too late? If you aren't very familiar with cryptocurrency but are looking at investing, here are the top tips for trading in cryptocurrency today. Look at real-world usage Most people are unaware of cryptocurrencies, and if you are considering investing in them, you need to look at real-world usage. According to Statista, only 24% of adults in the US are familiar with the most known cryptocurrency, with only 2% actually using cryptocurrencies and another 25% thinking of using it in the future. This potential increase in use should get investors excited. Cryptocurrency must solve a problem in life. Merely buying cryptocurrencies in hopes that they will deliver an investment return doesn't make a whole lot of sense. For every investor, the goal is to find a way to solve a problem. The more significant the issue that gets resolved, the higher the potential value. Create a portfolio with a limited number of cryptocurrencies As with every other kind of investment, investors should create a portfolio and actively work on it for the long term. Selectively choosing cryptocurrencies is imperative. You only want to invest in things that you understand and try to keep your emotions under control. Exchanging your cryptocurrencies for money Never forget that your cryptocurrency can be traded for traditional money. The market is currently in the process of enabling all exchanges, making the previous lock-in risk obsolete. As the market conditions change, make sure that you continue to exchange your crypto for cash. Read the right sources The internet today lets everybody and their uncle become experts during a hype. Be skeptical when following advice from people and selecting sources to read. The internet only has a handful of bloggers that are worth pursuing when it comes to cryptocurrency. Trading in cryptocurrency can be extremely confusing and risky. Keep these easy tips in mind as you navigate through the complex world of cryptocurrency. Top 4 Tips to Start Trading Cryptocurrencies The world of cryptocurrency is like no other, and when you enter into the world, everything is different. If you're just starting with trading cryptocurrencies, you'll quickly begin to realize just how different things are. Here are some of the top tips to help you begin to trade in cryptocurrency so that you can avoid making some of the more common mistakes. Tip number one, don't diversify too quickly. When it comes to investing, you may have been told to never put all your eggs in one basket when it comes to your portfolio. However, in the world of cryptocurrency trading, it is possible to diversify your investments too much and too soon. The reason you want to be careful with diversifying is that the digital currency landscape is still new, and it's impossible to know which cryptocurrencies are legitimate. You need to do your research and choose widely distributed coins that have shown their longevity. Tip number two, don't spend a lot of time trading. If you are constantly trading, you can actually end up making less profit. Since the crypto markets are so active, you may think that you will miss what looks like a fantastic profit opportunity, but there will be 5 or 10 more down the line. Spending every waking moment watching the price fluctuations can be exhausting and can lead to mistakes. Tip number 3. Don't panic The cryptocurrency scene is exceptionally volatile, which can create a ton of uncertainty for the novice trader. This can generate feelings of fear and panic, which is the worst emotional state you can be in when trading. Making decisions based on perceptions of panic can be disastrous, and you should never make decisions based on your alarm and fear. Tip number four, don't fall for scams. The natural inclination when investing in cryptocurrencies is to identify a new altcoin with the potential for growth, invest in it heavily when it's still inexpensive, and reap the rewards. However, because the industry is growing so quickly, it means that there are new currencies that might not be a good investment. Being cautious when it comes to investing in new cryptocurrencies will shield you from being involved in a scam, like the pump and dump schemes that are prevalent today. Trading in cryptocurrencies is exciting, exhilarating, and terrifying. To ensure that your trading career doesn't end before it can really get started, follow these tips and avoid the pitfalls of cryptocurrency trading.